and welcome to day five of the Comfort for Grief Challenge. I hope you guys are feeling well. And if you're not, I think day, day five is going to help you put everything in perspective. Day five of my book, Don't Grieve Alone, says, what's your vibe today? Is it excited for today? Is it ready for that morning coffee and try to wake up and tackle the day? Or is it dull and unmotivated? Your vibrations dictate your experience of the day. It will determine how your interactions will be with other people. So basically, if you have good, positive vibes, those are the experiences and the people that you will draw near to you. That's exactly the vibe you will attract. The same goes with the opposite. Negative vibes will bring and attract the like negative vibe. So as you get along your day, check your vibe. And don't forget the outcome of your day depends on it. Until next time, continue to be blessed indeed. Here is your prayer, scripture, and your challenge for the day. Let us pray. This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Dear Heavenly Father, please let me be tuned into my surroundings and the people I surround myself with. Continue to guide me and protect me from the negativities of this world. In Jesus' name I pray, amen, amen, and amen. Today's scripture comes from Colossians 1.11. May you be strengthened with all power according to his glorious might so that you may have great endurance, patience, and be filled with joy. Today's challenge is to pinpoint uplifting triggers that give you positive vibrations. Write down the people, situations, and activities that have given you happiness in the past. Review this list often and try to create these positive vibes in your life now. Let's connect. Schedule yourself and express yourself call at thekimberlyclark.com. Check out my social media pages. If you like what you see, like and follow me. Until next time, be blessed indeed.